USS Gerald R. Ford, CVN 78, is the largest warship the world has known, as of 2017 and it is also the largest aircraft carrier in terms of displacement. The ship Gerald R. Ford was officially entered into service with the U.S. Navy in 2017, two years behind schedule to be shipped in 2015. The Gerald R. Ford aircraft carrier was built by Northrop Grumman Shipbuilding at the Newport News Huntington Ingalls, formerly Northrop Grumman, shipyard in Newport News, Virginia, USA. Northrop Company started building this ship in 2005 under a contract package worth $2.7 billion. Later, the company officially signed a contract to design and build this aircraft carrier with the U.S. Navy, the contract value was then $5.1 billion. On August 11, 2005, Northrop Grumman held a ceremony to cut the steel for a 15-ton plate forming part of the carrier's side hulls, and this is considered the official date of construction of the ship. The -the state-of-the-art steel giant 1,106 foot 112,000 tons, USS Gerald R. Ford is able to launch 220 airstrikes per day from its two runways, hold 4,000 sailors and marines while appearing virtually invisible to enemy radar. This is Ilworka VKW's second largest power plant, operated by Ilworka VKW AG at Lake Vermont in the Austrian state of Vorarlberg. Plant operations are monitored fully automatically and remotely by the Ilworka VKW Control Center, IC, in Vandans. This power plant consists of two horizontal units and they operate independently of each other. Each unit consists of a Francis turbine, an engine generator, a clutch and a pump, associated control and regulation equipment and other ancillary systems. The engine compartment is about 117 meters long and 33 meters high, with a maximum width of about 33 meters and a wheelbase of about 25 meters. Two gantry cranes, each with a capacity of 130 tons, which can lift 250 tons when coupled, are installed under its ceiling. These pump units operate based on the flow of water from the Silvetta Reservoir at 2,030 meters above sea level to the Vermont Reservoir at 1,743 meters above sea level to generate electrical energy. Based on the rugged terrain in the area, which is prone to avalanches, this power station was designed as a cave power station. This not only significantly reduces the visual impact on the landscape, but also ensures the safety of the plant during an avalanche. The seven-pole motor generator manufactured by General Electric has a rated speed of 428.5 per minute. There are two generator motors belonging to two different units, they are located between the turbine and the pump and are separated from the turbine by a load clutch and from the pump by a converter.
The type of turbine used in this generator complex is the Francis turbine, manufactured by Andritz AG with a total capacity of 360 megawatts including two units. The transformer compartment is connected to the engine compartment with a total length of about 46 meters, about 19 meters high and 19.5 meters wide. Transformers of two units and an additional network coupled transformer, SF6 high voltage switchgear, ventilation and heating system components are installed in the transformer compartment. After commissioning the second unit at the end of 2018 and testing in the first half of 2019, the plant was opened on June 7, 2019.